Gator has moved in. They're all in line. We are ready for the start. They're off in the Belmont Stakes. And Destin had a very good beginning, but there goes Gettysburg as expected. Sent to the lead by Paco Lopez, and Destin is close as to stablemate Stradivari. And then to the outside, there goes right to the outside of them, Seeking the Soul, who's three deep into that turn. Cherry Wine sits back and runs in fifth. Exaggerator's not far behind. He's three wide into the turn as Governor Malibu saves all the ground. Then Brody's Cause, Seeking the Soul, three lengths more. And then comes Forever Doro, racing on the outside of Creator, who's been guided to the rail. Lonnie is second last, Trojan Nation trails, and the first quarter was solid enough. It was 24 seconds flat. So it is Gettysburg the leader on this expansive first turn at Belmont Park. Gettysburg in front by a length and a half. Destin tracks in second position. Seeking the Soul follows in third. Stradivari's in between horses. Exaggerators moving up on the outside and is strongly held by Kent DeSormo. Four deep up the backstretch. Then Governor Malibu followed by Cherry Wine. Brody's cause is right behind his stablemate. And he's six lengths off the lead up the backstretch. Lonnie has gone by a few horses now. And Lonnie is moving up on the outside. Then Creator, sudden breaking news. And Forever Doro, the half was in 48 and two. Three quarters up in one minute, 13 and one fifth seconds. And Trojan Nation is well behind the field. So Gettysburg leads the charge up the backstretch in front by a length. It is Destin who continues to pursue in second. Stradivari is right there, and so is Exaggerator. The Preakness winner is fourth in right to the outside of a ground-saving Governor Malibu, who is sent along by Joel Rosario down on the inside. Gettysburg has been there all the way so far. Destin continues to pursue him. Stradivari is close. Exaggerator is two lengths off the lead, four wide on the turn. Then Governor Malibu, creator. Lonnie still with five lengths to make up. And then it's Cherry Wine. Sudden breaking news goes wide and forever Doro. It is still Gettysburg who will turn into the stretch with Destin right on his outside. And they're into the stretch. And Destin has taken the lead in the Belmont Stakes. Stradivari is there. Governor Malibu couldn't get through on the inside. He is in traffic. Exaggerator. Here comes Lonnie on the far outside. And Creator is coming too. It is Destin in front. Creator. Lonnie on the outside. Destin and Creator, these two come down to the line together, too close to goal! It was Creator and Destin right on the wire, and Irad Ortiz raised his whip in victory, but it is very close in the Belmont Stakes. Well, you see Irad Ortiz standing in the irons and celebrating. He thinks, obviously, that he has won the race. Larry said it was too close to call as Creator came storming up on the outside and Kent DeSormo and Exaggerator will not get the victory today. Uh, the most striking thing, Tom, congratulations. Very good ride by Arad Ortiz. I didn't really know if a horse that came as, from far back as Creator could get the job done, but he certainly finished strongly. He got wiped out, we remember, in the Kentucky Derby at the top of the stretch when he was right behind Exaggerator and moving. Uh, in terms of Exaggerator, I think Kent had him in a good spot. He got a little strong early. Let's look at the deep stretch here. Looks like all grays. Destin with the yellow silks, gray on the inside. Creator the gray with the white silks and the blinkers on the outside. And here and it is. Lonnie third. The fourth nose finish in history of the Belmont Stakes. We thought it was creator on the outside as I read Ortiz thought and it looks from that angle like it was. Here's a look right down the finish line. Head bobbing nose finish. Sure looks like the outside. It appears from that angle to be the outside horse creator. And it's now it's now on the board. So unofficially creator. And once again, an Arkansas Derby winner takes the Belmont Stakes. Last year, it was American Pharaoh. This time, it's Creator, and there's the official photo. Creator edging Destin. Let's go to Donna. Well, I read on the Gallup out, even before they posted it, you said, I won the race. So you knew when you crossed the wire, you had it. Yeah, first I want to say thanks, Goran, the trainer and owner. They give me the opportunity to ride the horse. Steve and Music do a great job, and thank, thanks him. I'm here today. I'm, I'm riding this horse today. And he was coming. I just waved somewhere to go. So when he got clear, he started running. He was coming. He told me he's going to be all right in the mile and a half. And he was right. I know. I know he passed me. 
past the other horse. Arad, you've been riding in New York since 2011. You've won tons of races here, but this is your first Belmont Stakes win, the crowning jewel of Belmont Park. What's it mean to you to win this race? It's an amazing feeling. It's, it's very, very important for me, and I'm very happy. I wanna, wanna say thanks to everyone who helped me. I wanna, this race is gonna be for my daughter, that she's here today, and I'm very happy. Obviously an emotional win for you. Your grandfather, uncle, and your brother were all past or present jockeys. Does this feel like a win for the Ortiz family? Yes, they, 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 are, they are so happy, all the Ortiz right now. Congratulations, go celebrate. Let's go to Kenny Rice. All right, thanks, Donna. The rain is coming down a little bit now. Whoa! It won't dampen your no, spirit, no. Steve Asmus, and congratulations on the win. Did you have it all the way? Oh, no, I was glad to see him put that number up. They came to the wire together. You know, I read, gave him a dream trip. Horse ran super. Team did a great job. Very proud. So many times people can say, well, he had an excuse. You seem to think that he certainly had an excuse in Kentucky and was ready immediately to try him at Belmont to give him that rest. He proved his worth today. You know, thank the wins, Elliot, the wind star team, Mr. Trout. Just very thankful for this opportunity with a great horse. Congratulations on the Hall of Fame, and you get a Belmont on top of it. Yes, look good on the plaque. Thank you very much. Congratulations, Steve. Let's thank go to Bob. This is turning. Yeah. All right, Kenny, this is turning into some year for Steve Asperson, is it not? As Arad Ortiz takes creator back home by the Windstar Farm and Bobby Flay, the celebrity chef. Yeah.